Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I have a haul video for you guys, which is some stuff that I purchased myself and some stuff that was sent to me, so I'll make sure and put down in the description box below so you guys know. And I have a whole bunch of stuff from Daily Charm, Light Elegance, Magpie USA, Magpie Beauty, and uh, some Erica stuff. So I hope you guys enjoy this haul video and let's get it started. Okay, so the first box that we have here is from Daily Charm and I am so excited because I've just become an affiliate with them, which if you have watched any of my past videos, I already order from them and I already love their products. So the, I was so excited when they asked if I wanted to be an affiliate for Daily Charm and I cannot wait to show you guys all of these gorgeous colors. and. I now have a discount code for them, which is KD10, which will save you 10% off your order with Daily Charm. And they carry a whole bunch of nail art products as well as gel polishes and different things like that. So they're like one of my favorite nail art product store or supply. If you watch my tortoiseshell tutorial, I use their gel polishes for the tortoiseshell and it is like my favorite. So definitely check that out and don't forget to use my code if you end up ordering from them. And everything came in this really cute little box with some pink tissue paper. Everything's so cute from them and I love their packaging. So I wanted to show you guys their gel polishes to begin with. And I got a couple different varieties. And the cool thing about their gel polishes is that they are available to anyone. So I know I've gotten a lot of questions from people asking about gel polishes or gel brands that anybody can buy. So you do not have to have a license to purchase these. So anybody can purchase their gel polishes. So. I am super excited to show you guys. So these are, this is their gel polish brand, which is called Charm Gel. And it has this lovely gold handle. I think it's so pretty. And you can see what the color is gonna be and the name or the number on the top, as well as this little heart right here shows you what color it's gonna be. So I got a couple different ones to show you guys. So these ones are just their regular like cream, gel polishes, just their standard, like no shimmer color gel polishes. And you can tell by the top here. Now these ones are super gorgeous. I cannot wait to show you guys these ones. I like barely peeked at them too. These ones, um, you'll notice they have an S and they have little sparkles. So I think it stands for shimmer or sparkle. So these ones are gonna be some really gorgeous shimmery gel polishes. And then these two have an H on them and they also have some little, you know, sparkle symbols. And the that stands for holographic. So holographic number 83 and number 84. And they have names as well as the numbers. So these ones are their, they call them their tinted glass gels. So these are gonna be like your jellies or your clear, you know, like the clear glass gels. That's what these colors are gonna be. So I got a couple different colors to show you guys. And I am so excited. I already peeked at some of them and they're absolutely stunning. So I'm gonna show you guys these colors to begin with from Daily Charm. So this first one is number 701 and it's called Garden Party. And it's a really, really pretty green. It's almost a little bit minty green, except it's not extremely pastel. So it's a really nice green. I actually don't think I have anything quite like this green shade in my collection. Next is number 603 and it's called Lemonade. It's a really nice, like your standard yellow. It's looking a little bit more mustardy in person, just a tiny bit. 
but it's just like your nice like primary yellow, not neon, not pastel, like right in the middle, perfect lemon yellow. Then we have number 404, which is Cherry Lips, which is gonna be in between like a nice pink berry red. As far as the shimmers go, this one's number S85 and it's called Luminescence. And oh my gosh, these are so pretty. So it looks like it's got some iridescent, maybe a tiny bit of like holographic glitters in there. And it's this gorgeous like purpley to pink iridescent shimmery color. Next is number S81 called Moon Dust. And again, these ones are those like iridescent shimmery shades. And this one is absolutely gorgeous. Like this one blows my mind. Like it's so, so pretty. I just want to put it on my thumb just to see like when you turn, like it just has that gorgeous like iridescent reflection. It's so, so stunning. Next is number S83 and it's called Celeste and it's the same type of thing, but this one's more of a pink. Seriously, I need like this whole like shimmer collection because these are stunning. Like, oh my gosh, so, so pretty. Then for these ones, these are the holographic ones. This one's number H83 and it's called Karma. So these ones are so, oh my gosh, this one is so pretty. So the holographic is not super chunky. This is not like a chunky glitter. It's like a color that has a really fine holographic glitter inside of it. And this is kind of like, um, maybe like a mauve -y kind of plum color, but it has this really fine holographic, gorgeous shimmer in it. Then this one's number H80 which is called serendipity and it's another one of these really fine holographic colors this one's much more a lighter more neutral color but it has that same really really fine holographic glitter in it and lastly I got two of the tinted glass gels uh, this one's a green one, which is T07, and it's called Absinthe. And I have a lime green glass gel right now, but this one is a much darker emerald green. It's so pretty. I'll just show you guys, like, because it kind of looks black when I pull it out, but you can see that it's definitely green. And then lastly is T08, which is called Caribbean Mist, which is gonna be your gorgeous, like oceany teal color, kind of like a turquoise, which I do not have a jelly color in this shade yet. So gorgeous. I'll show you guys really quick. There you go. Has a little bit more green in it than it might be showing up on my camera. It's more of like that turquoise. Okay, some other things that came in the Daily Charm package, some foil transfer gel, which I'm excited to try their foil gel. I have a couple different ones, uh, so I'll be interested in trying this one out. Maybe I should film like a battle of the foil transfer gels, because I think I have quite a few at this point, but um, so we'll try this one. This will be really nice to try. Then I grabbed some stickers, a couple different stickers here. This is like a holographic butterfly sticker. It's like a rainbow. It's so got all the whole bunch of different colors in there. Uh, this is a light pink rose sticker. And then your standard like red rose sticker also. Then I grabbed these, which are, they almost remind me of like striping tape, but it's already cut. I don't think it's sticky at all. I think they're just like loose little strips. Uh, I'm excited to try these out and it's really, really thin little strips in there. I got this holographic shell foil, which is really pretty. So if you're looking to do some like really cool, like abalone shell nails, this foil has the shell print, but also has that holographic look to it. So 
that's really cool. Grabbed some glitters. This one is the Chameleon Star Glitter Mix. And I thought this one was so cool because these stars, they don't look like your normal like glitter stars. Like they have almost like a 3D look to them. And there's multiple different colors and sizes in here. So I thought that was really cool, especially if you put this over black, like they would totally pop over black. Then we have this one, which is like a holographic, chunky uh, mix with different shapes, some like hearts, stars, moons, some little bar glitters in there, just like a whole bunch of different variety in holographic. The cutest little like pastel iridescent flowers, which would be perfect for spring, which I know we're kind of coming out of spring right now, but uh, definitely next year, these are gonna be perfect for spring. Then I grabbed this one, which is a mix of different colored iridescent seashells. This one is so cool and the seashells are pretty big. So you definitely have to encapsulate these things there because they are pretty big. Like you can see compared to my pinky now, like you might only be able to fit one or two on there, but they are so pretty though. I've never seen these ones. So these ones for summer, definitely, because this is gonna be like vacation, beach nails, all that kind of stuff. Uh, these ones are gonna be so pretty. And then I also grabbed some of these little, they're not glitters, they're like little, really thin pieces of like paper. So this is like their summer flower one, I think. So you got some leaves and some different flowers that are kind of like tropical. So this is kind of cool. And these, I did use these, um, just a different kind on one of my clients once, and you can kind of bend them and stuff because they are paper to kind of bend them around the nail. So that's kind of cool. And lastly, from Daily Charm, I got two packs of these dried flowers that you can use for encapsulating. And this first pack, it has some of these like really big, like different flowers, all different colors, just kind of like a good variety. It's got some leaves in there. It's got some of those like little tiny flowers that you can kind of cut and separate. And then this pack has some different flowers that I have not used yet. They're more of like these bigger flowers with these bigger leaves. Like so the leaves are pretty big, like as you can see compared to my thumb, like one leaf right there. But I've seen some gorgeous nails done with these types of flowers and I've never used them before. So I thought these ones would be pretty too. I love that purple shade. So yeah, two packs of different kinds of dried flowers, which my clients love the dried flower trend. Okay, I did some quick swatches of those gel colors. Definitely this green is really unique for my collection. I don't have a green like that so far. So far I have like a pastel, really light mint green. And then from there it jumps to like army green. So this is like the perfect uh, kind of up from the pastel green. Love the yellow. I'm so excited about these like shimmery, like the two holographic and the shimmery gel polishes as well as the tinted glass. So there's the two holographic next to each other. I just did these swatches really quick, so really gorgeous. And then here's those three shimmery shades. This one is definitely the most like see-through. So you could apply this one like over any color and it would make any color like that iridescent shimmer. So these next few things are from Nashley Nails and they carry nail art products as well, as well as some gel products. And they sent me some of their gel polishes from the brand. I'm probably gonna say this wrong, but Har Haruyama gel polish. That's what I'm gonna go with. I may be saying that incorrectly. <laughs> um, and then as well as some more of the cat eye gel polishes. And these ones are in a pot, so that's kind of cool. And something about these gel polishes, I've already swatched them and I was pretty impressed. Like my first impressions of them is they go on really nice and they're really pigmented. And these gel polishes, again, are also available for anyone to purchase and they are a really, really good price point. So if you are on a budget or if you're just starting out, I believe these are only like $6.99, which is really, really good. Uh, 
So if keep that in mind, like if you're just looking to try a couple gel polishes or you don't have that much to spend, I would check these out because from my first impressions, they seem pretty nice. So I'm gonna show you guys these colors and they did send me 001, which is gonna be their white. It looks like it needs a little bit of a stir, but it looks like a really nice bright white. Next is number 339. And this one is a really pretty kind of bright pastel purple. This one is number 959. I'm totally going out of order here. And this one's a really pretty peachy orange color. This one's number 291. And this one is actually, I think it's like a jelly purple because I did swatch it already. And it is like a dark purple, but you can see that it is see-through. So I think number 291 might be more of like a jelly purple. We have number 966, which is a really bright coral pink. This one's really, really pretty. Number 438, which is a neutral, like taupey tan color. And number 964, which is a bright pink. So again, these are really good price. And I did want to mention they are eight mils or 0.27 ounces. So they are a little bit of a smaller bottle, but if you're just trying to get gel polish for your own nails, usually you're not going to need that much. So uh, the Daily Charm gel polishes are quite a bit bigger and they are 15 mils. So almost double the size of this one. And I believe the Daily Charm gel polishes are $18 and these are $6.99. So just to kind of give you an idea there. But now these are their Double Galaxy. This is the Cat Eye Gels. And these are that by the brand Ice Gel. So Ice Gel, they also make a lot of other Cat Eye Gels as well as those like flash on, flash off gels. This one's number 1115. A really pretty shimmery light blue. So I'm curious, like I'm gonna have to play around with these and kind of see how they look after using the cat eye and stuff, but I bet they are so pretty. This one's number 1114. It's a really pretty shimmery pink. 1117, which is a really pretty like darker plum kind of a purple color. And number 1116, which is kind of a orangey kind of terracotta color. Looks like I probably should stir them before I use them. They look a little bit separated, so they probably should get a good stir before using. So that's everything that I got from Nashley Nails. And again, I do have a coupon code for them as well, which is KD10, which will save you 10%, which makes these gel polishes like even more of a good deal because you can save an extra 10% on them. And these are what the colors are swatched. And I haven't had a chance to swatch these ones yet, but it's definitely on my list. So I'm gonna have to like kind of go through these fairly quickly because I don't want this video to take like a million years. And if I swatch every single thing on camera, it will take a long time. So eventually I'll swatch these. And if you check out my Instagram and stuff, I will probably post them there as well. Okay, the next group of items are from Magpie USA. I've got a couple things from them. So we have, these are the multi-use abrasive pads. So I believe these are their new like lint free pads. They're supposed to be hundred percent lint free. So there's a hundred in there to try. They also recently came out with their new neon inks. So I have all of their other inks and these are the, their newest edition, which are supposed to be neon. I actually have made this little paper for myself uh, just for reference if I ever want to use an ink so I can kind of see what colors they have. Like it's hard to tell exactly what color it's gonna be when it's inside the bottle. So I made this little like swatch, you know, reference sheet for myself. So I'll just kind of swipe them on here so we can see what kind of colors. These are all of the other Magpie ones that they have. So we have neon orange. Ooh, that's pretty. It's like a, kind of like a corally orange but this is their other orange. It's more of like a rust kind of a co color. So that's the new 
neon orange. Then we have neon yellow. Oh dang, that is like really, really neon. So that's the new neon yellow. This would be so pretty and bright over white nails. We have neon purple. These are very, very pigmented. I definitely think some of their other colors were a little bit lighter. These ones, these new ones are definitely like super pigmented. And lastly, neon pink. Ooh, that is so bright. I'm really excited about these. I hope they make neons in all the colors, like neon blue and stuff, because that is super, super bright neon pink. So we have the orange, yellow, purple, and pink now to add to our collection here. Next, we got some new floral foils from Magpie. So these are gonna be your transfer foils and they have a whole bunch of different new floral patterns to choose from. This one is Wally. It's got like some pink and purple flowers on it. This one is Basil. This one is Sunny. This one is Ringo. And I believe this one looks like it's a clear backed foil. This one is Quincy, which also looks like a clear backed foil, but it looks like it has stripes on it. Ooh. Okay, so it's got like some light blue stripes on it with some darker blue flowers. So that's Quincy, that's really pretty. I haven't seen one like that before. We have Doug, this one is Austin. This one is Orlando, which looks really pretty blue. And lastly, we have Greg. They also have some new shells, which is so exciting. These are gonna be awesome for summer. So like shell nails are super popular right now. They are very in. So they came out with a whole bunch of different colors of these shell pieces. I believe they're like a real shell. They're very stiff, but you can actually break them up into smaller pieces. So they're pretty thin, but they're very stiff. So you would have a hard time like encapsulating just this giant piece. So uh, I believe they're easy to kind of like break apart and you can make up a lot smaller pieces. And they have seven colors of these really cool shell pieces. Here is like the teal color. That is so pretty, like the way that these kind of have that pearlescent, like iridescent look to them, they're so cool. So for Magpie, their gel and acrylic products, you do have to have a license to purchase. However, any of their nail art products, so their inks, uh, their glitters, these shell pieces, foils, anything like that, you do not have to have a license to purchase. So you can purchase any of the nail art products without a license. Next is from Erica's. Uh, you guys have seen me use Erica's bits and stuff. If you've watched my past videos, I use them on every client. I love the Erica's bits implements. Anything that has to do with e-files or bits, absolutely love, my favorite. So I grabbed two more of their Boss Lady Nippers. These are hands down my favorite nippers and I have recently dropped one of them and I accidentally threw another one away, which absolutely kills me. So I picked up two more of the Boss Lady Nippers so I could kind of restock those as well as some new bits. So I got two new of the Russian nib bits that I use on my clients for their cuticle area. That's what I use to prep the nail, remove any you know dead skin that's stuck on the nail. Love the Russian nib bits for that. I got one new carbide barrel. This is their violet carbide. And the violet coating is supposed to help it last longer as well as have it not get so hot. So, and then I got two new diamond barrels as well. So the diamond barrel is not, it doesn't have teeth on it. So it's not gonna cut anything. It's more of gonna be like a sandpaper. Whereas the carbide barrel, actually has teeth on it. So this is what I would use to remove product, old product. This is what I remove for shaping, going underneath the nail, uh, removing gel polish on your natural nail. You can use that, I wouldn't use this one, but um, so that's the difference between those two. So I got two of those as well. 
So that's from Erica's. And if you need to order anything from them, I also have a code, which is AMB10. And I will make sure and put all the codes and everything down in the description box below. Okay, last but not least, we have a bunch of stuff from Light Elegance, which is one of my favorite favorite companies for their glitter gels. I absolutely love their glitter gels and their colors. They make such beautiful colors. So lastly, we have a big package from them. So to start off with, we got the Light Elegance Butter Blings. These came out, um, I don't know exactly when, but it's been a while, I believe, and I have never used them before. And these are their like glitter butter creams or their butter blings as they call it, which if you haven't used their butter creams, I highly recommend it. They are so nice. I love using them for nail art as well as like a full color nail and they go, go on it so thin. So these are their butter blings, which are supposed to be like a glittery butter cream that goes on so nice and thin. So this one is in the shade Jade. This one is a really gorgeous Jade Green shade. Black Opal, which is like one of my favorites. Like, hello, look how stunning that is. It's black and then it has purple, green, blue, pink, all these like little flecks in there and it's just absolutely stunning. Oh my gosh. And if you notice, I have little like, uh, I was just working on clients all day and I was using pigments and stuff. So if you see any of that, that's why. Uh, sapphire, which is going to be your really pretty sapphire blue. And then the hollow butter bling, which is going to be your gorgeous holographic silver. And when I look at it up close, it almost looks like it's like different little like size flakes and shapes of glitter. Like there's a whole bunch going on in this one. Then we have the cowgirl country spring 2021 buttercream collection so this one's going to be more of like spring shades this one is sexy and suede which is a really pretty almost terracotta color this one is chaps and spurs it's a really nice like neutral pink shade lucky horseshoe which is going to be your minty turquoisey shade, knockin' boots, dusty purple, sunrise roundup, which is a shimmery coral shade. I wanna use this one like on somebody because this one is gorgeous. It's so pretty and shimmery. And lastly, little Philly, which is gonna be a pink with a little bit of shimmer in there. So these ones, I still need to swatch. I haven't had a chance to swatch these ones yet. Definitely, if you have questions about certain products or you wanna see more about certain products, you know, specifically, then let me know because when I do a haul video like this with this much stuff, I just don't have time to like sit and swatch everything because the video will be so long. So those are the Cowgirl Country, the Spring, 2020, the spring 2021 Buttercream Collection. Next is the brand new Summer 2021. This is their gel polish and glitter gel collection because I've never actually used their new P Plus gel polish yet. I have a couple of the glitters, but I've never used like their just colored gel polish yet. So I thought that would be kind of cool to see. So for the new summer shades, we have Sandman Tan, Power Nap, Dream On, Counting Coral Sheep, Fuchsia Fantasy, and Night Terror Teal. For the new glitters, we have Sleepy Time, In My Happy Place, Restful Rose, Pinch Me Pink, Tangerine Dream, and Deja Blue. I also got sent the P Plus Hello Kit, which includes a bottle of the Jimmy Gel, which is like Light Elegance's builder in a bottle, the top coat for P Plus, the base coat, as well as another color, which this one is kind of like a mauve -y 
color. It's really pretty. I can't remember what the name is, but uh, this one is really nice as well. So now I have the top coat and base coat. If I'm doing a natural nail manicure with gel polish, I try to stick within the same line so I know that everything's gonna attach well. It's not gonna do anything weird. So I got the P Plus Cutie Base as well as their top coat. Also got in the other four colors of Jimmy Gel. So that one that came in the kit is clear. So we have the Boomer White, Natural, Soft Pink, and Ideal Pink. So I haven't opened them yet, but you can kind of tell like what type of a color it's gonna be based on the bottle. I believe the Boomer White is if you wanna do a baby boomer, this one is supposed to be really good for that and you can pair it with probably the Soft Pink or the Ideal Pink. Also got in some of the Light Elegance gel paints. This is their neon set. And I have used their gel paints a really, really long time ago. And it was an old formulation, but I have not used these new formulated gel paints. So I'm excited to try these as well because I love using gel paints when I'm hand painting like detailed stuff. So we got blue, orange, purple, green, pink, and a yellow. Also got in a little smaller size of their bamboo lotion as well as their Ellie Pro hand sanitizer. And I have not used the hand sanitizer, but I have used their lotion and I love it. Their spa line, the Q and Lou spa line, it smells so nice. Like I love their spa line. So this is more of like, you know, a lotion that you can fit in your purse or something, more of a smaller size. Also got in some of their brushes and some nail art brushes as well as a gel polish brush. So we have the stripey brush, which is their striping brush, as well as the swirly brush, which is a little bit shorter than the striping brush. I don't know how well you can see them in the plastic. There you go. So this one's a little bit shorter and this one's gonna be your long striping brush. This one, I love the swirly brush as well as the striping brush. I've been using these brushes for like quite a while and they definitely probably should be updated because <laughs> they're getting a little bit, you know, gunky and stuff in the where the brush is just from using them a lot. So I'm excited to have a replacement for the stripey and the swirly brush as well as their gel polish brush. This one I love to use when I'm applying gels that come in a pot. So uh, as far as like color, so color gels that come in a pot, I'm going to reach for their gel polish brush. So this is one of my favorites as well. Okay, that's everything from Light Elegance. A uh, nice big box came in from them. So that's so exciting, I love these new colors and I love these butter blinks. I cannot wait to use those butter blinks on a client. Have you guys tried any of these products out yet? Are one of these colors like your absolute favorite? Definitely let me know. And again, let me know if there's anything specific you would like more information about because I have to go through this stuff pretty quickly in order to get through it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all of you. I appreciate everyone who comments, likes my videos. It really means a lot. So thank you guys again. And don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.